Our team coverage continues now in Gulf Shores. CBS 42 News reporter Jamie Ostroff is there live. She's been keeping an eye on the beach conditions all day. Jamie. Sherry, those beach conditions very, very, very bad. Nate just told you how fast those winds were blowing, and you can see it right now. This is a hold on to your hat situation. Look at the trees. Look at the flags. There's wind. There is water everywhere, and this water just adding to some of the conditions that we saw. Take a look at this video. Keep in mind, we shot this a couple of hours ago. We've got parking lots here in Gulf Shores and even a little further inland up towards Foley looking like lakes. The water just keeps getting higher. Of course, we are still under all sorts of flood warnings going into the evening, even into tomorrow. I actually caught up with one woman who was visiting from Tuscaloosa. She said she has not taken any chances. She is getting out of here. We don't know what it's going to do when you're in a camper, you know. So it's best to just head on out, not deal with it. And we'll come back another day. And you see the video there, those red flags. That means the storm is creating extremely dangerous surf conditions. And if you want to get back out to our live pictures right now, there is not a soul out here. This storm is bearing down. It has only gotten worse in the past hour. This is something that we are keeping an eye on, and we will have live shots throughout the evening on CBS 42. But for now, reporting live in Gulf Shores, Jamie Ostroff, CBS 42 News, local coverage you can count on.